Welcome back. It was a historic launch from Florida's Space Coast. That SpaceX rocket carrying four astronauts is on its way to the International Space Station as we speak. Isn't that amazing to think about? Mm -hmm. Eight on your side, meteorologist and space enthusiast Amanda Holly joins us from the Kennedy Space Center with all the details on this incredible feat. For the third time in less than a year, humans were launched from U.S. soil into space early Friday morning. The Crew Dragon capsule named Endeavour is now on its way to meet up with the International Space Station. Um, the ascent was incredible. The ride was really smooth. Uh, we couldn't have asked for anything better. Uh, there may have been some hooting and giggling up here uh, while all that was going on. The view from here at Kennedy Space Center was just as stunning. As the rocket continued to ascend, the sun's rays began illuminating the rocket's flare. We also got an incredible view of the first stage booster firing its Merlin engines as it controlled its descent back to Earth. Now, after docking with the International Space Station early Saturday morning, the crew will have a six-month stay full of critical research. What we do on ISS is important, um, not only for the research and technology de development that we do for here on Earth, but also to prepare for what we're going to do in the future. The crew will continue growing plants as well as furthering medical research on cells and tissues. They also have several spacewalks planned to install upgraded solar arrays. For several days, there will be 11 total astronauts on board the ISS. However, the team from Crew 1 is scheduled to return back to Earth Wednesday. NASA's commercial crew program is now well underway. The plan moving forward is to have regular six-month rotations of a new crew. Reporting from Kennedy Space Center, Amanda Holly, 8 on your side. And check this out. Turns out you can see the launch from all the way over here in the Bay Area. Viewer Jody McDevitt sent us this awesome video from West Chase. You can see the rocket lighting up the sky as it left the atmosphere. We have a lot more pictures and videos from Bay Area viewers who are up early. We have a gallery up right now on WFLA. Com. If you didn't know there was a rocket blasting off, you might be like, what's going on? Well, you went on social media and it was everywhere. <laughs> it was so, everywhere. So cool to see it. It was it, really early in the morning. <laughs>